All right, we're hoping this might be the one. Wow, this one feels big. This one feels big, boo. So, sorry, Black Series. Welcome back. Welcome back to Kenton and Habiba. Today we're doing something we've never done before, which is going to tour some travel campers or RVs for the first time ever. Super, super excited. The prices range from 20000 all the way up to over 100000 I apologize in advance how excited I'm going to be and how many times I'm going to say, wow. <laughs> Over there. Should we go into the office and see? Or just go stop walking? But we can't really go inside. Like, yeah, I can already see the, those are the ones I'm thinking like, this is huge. This is like me, you, my mom, <laughs> the whole family. This is huge. large see so, yeah I'm thinking this is around the size that I'm thinking yeah this is what I'm thinking okay so the length is 18 feet yeah 18 feet 18 feet right the by weight is 3,000 pounds that's about so, the maximum towing. The, the minivan so, would be able to pull yeah, that yeah the minivan towing safely is like 35 if I'm not mistaken, these are the ones that run for about twenty to twenty-three thousand. Oh wait, it's open. Let's go in. Let's go in. Oh, my first time going in. I go up the steps. Wow. Oh my God. Can you imagine? What? It's cute. What? Look at the stove. This one's got a two burner stove. So it's gas. Yeah. yeah. I don't know how you open this. It says, please raise glass before cooking. And I just that. leave it. Yeah, you just, you just raised it. And then this has got a pretty decent size sink. sink. Yeah. With a drain. Yeah. And if you have a nice view here with the window yeah. instead of a black splat backsplash, and then yeah. this has got the this is almost a full size microwave. Yeah. And then you've got kitchen cabinet here for like your food and your uh, cereal and whatever and your pots maybe. You've got another cabinet here with the shelving. And here, you know, cooking utensils. And then, see, you would think, oh, yeah, you know what I like? It's got a fridge. This is a standing fridge. You know, you're not like stooping down low. Right. It's not the short one. This is great. Yeah. This is to like keep it from falling yeah, yeah. while you're moving. Opening the doors. Open right. Up. Yeah, no, this is a big enough fridge. Yeah. Oh. That's crazy. And freezer. And then look, more storage. Right. I think that's more than enough storage for the weekend. And I imagine that this couch, yeah. maybe this couch um, opens up into a, a bed. bed. Yeah. Yeah, so I'm not sure where there's a table, but I've seen in some of the oh, units. It's above you. Um, that goes down. I wonder if this is a Murphy bed or what's up here, or another bed. I don't know, I'm but sure. it looks like it comes down. Yeah. But you could put like a little table to eat. Mm. I mean, it's small. It feels like one room. But on the other hand, it has so many functions. I like right. it. And then what's in here? Storage. Storage. And you can see there are outlets. Yeah. There should be a smoke detector. There's a fan. There's yeah. vent. This, there one, it, this one's equipped with a um, television antenna. So for oh, Wi-Fi and stuff. No, yeah, they have another. Yeah. You know. Let me see. Let me just see. Oh, you know what? I think yeah. this is like a second bed. Uh -huh. Right. Because you could actually have like, I think this opens up into a bed and yeah. this is another bed. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Even though I'm not sure, we, you might fall off this. Well, 
Maybe. Maybe. But it's cute. I'm excited. Mm -hmm. You know, you got to speak it into existence. But you said speak into existence? Yes. I speak a second one. <laughs> Who wants to see Kenton and Habiba travel and get on the road and see parts of the United States we haven't seen before. We could go to Oregon. We could go all the way to California. We could go all over and have adventures in our little caravan. We would drive with, a, with our minivan attached and then get to a camping ground and then just, oh! <laughs> I'm yeah, so excited. As if, I, or as if I already have the money. So people, what do I need from you? I need to start a donation. I think I'm gonna start a uh, travel camp donation. Don't you think, Boo Boo? No. You don't think I should start no. a, uh, a donation? Yeah. Help Ken and Abiba be homeless and drive around in a, in a camper. I'm all for that. Yeah! <laughs> all right, Boo Boo, let's see another unit. You know what's missing here? A window besides this one's got the window by the stove. Oh, the bathroom. We didn't even look at the bathroom. Come on, boo. What are you doing? I'm demonstrating. You're demonstrating what? I'm you You need to lose some weight. You know you were doing that on purpose. I wonder, is that one of those compost toilets? Boo, don't be crude. Was that one of those compost toilets? I have no idea. I don't know. No, it looks like it it goes down it goes down let's yeah. see it's got a shower yeah there's a shower oh right wow there. it's got a whole sink yeah. medicine cabinet got a medicine cabinet yeah. it's got outlets it's got a sink faucet yeah. more storage nice toilet wow this is a pretty impressive looking size shower it's a pretty large shower look you can see the handles the drain Okay, all right, well, there's a window here. This is a pretty luxurious size bathroom. I mean, let me put it to the floor so you can see the floor space. That's cool. All right, yeah. So Forest River, Ozark, Ozark? Ozark. Oh, look, so this has got the awning. Yeah, this has got the awning above the door that opens up. And I'm sure there's got a lot more storage somewhere outside this camper. And these are like where you would have the connections also for the drainage. Of course, you got the propane tank over here. All right, yeah, I want to see in here where it has the big window. That's that's what I would like. I hope it has most of the features we just saw plus. Let's see, is it open? Yeah. All right, let's see. Ooh, okay, 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 okay. Going up the steps. Oh, wow. This one feels big. I want to say like Tiffany Haddish. This is nice. This one feels big, boo. Look at this. This feels like a whole diner over here. Yeah, it's got the table. Is it bigger on yeah, the outside? Yeah, it's bigger. What? This one feels big. Look. It's got the window over there. I don't even know where to start. It's got the window over there. It's got storage. It's got a bed or room for a bed over there. It's got this giant like seating couch. Um, another window on the side. You turn, you've got the window here with the little dinette. I bet you that has storage underneath. And then over here, it looks like they have like a little fireplace. Um, wow, look at the stainless steel fridge the large stainless steel fridge over here. And when you turn this way, yeah, you're looking at the kitchen. There's a television. There is pretty much a whole kitchen, kitchenette, because you can see the microwave. You can see the storage. Um, this is the sink with a nice grill on top. See, it lifts up. And 
and nice. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Y'all, I need you to send your prayers our way so we can go on the road and experience camping and a whole life out there. <laughs> if you've ever dreamed about doing something, well, it was kind of on my bucket list for a while, but I always knew like I didn't like I wouldn't want to do camping outside on the floor, but I thought about a camper. And lately I've just been obsessed with these um, camping videos. In particular, if you look and find, you'll see Koreans do a lot of camping videos. Oh, this is an induction stove. That's the only thing though. I kind of prefer a gas stove. I mean, you know, I'm not gonna complain. <laughs> Oh my God, there's like two other beds in here. What? You guys, you see how on the outside it looks small, right? Look, they are. there are two other beds or sleeping pods. Wow. And then here's the refrigerator. Oh yeah, I gotta do this. Standing full refrigerator. I mean, this is bigger than many apartments. You could be on the road literally for weeks, maybe even months. This is like a pantry. Yep. Oh, I am so impressed. I am so impressed. All I need is about <laughs> $20,000. Oh, just $20,000 on the side. You know, instead of saving for a house, I could take $20,000 and buy this, right? <laughs> Does that make any sense, people? I don't know. All right, so let's try the bathroom. We've got the toilet. And usually, you know, I do not want a, um, what do you call it? I don't want one of those combustible toilets or those off-grid toilets. I believe these can um, connect to piping or connect to the sewer system at whatever camping site you're on. Anyway, here's the shower. It is a full standing shower. You see the compartments. There's the shower head. I hope I'm not making you dizzy. Shower curtain. Drain. Yep, and this is the view from the bathroom. Wow, I really like this unit as well because this one, even though it feels small, I could totally see five of us in here i could see each of our kids in here plus us without feeling too crowded even though i'm not sure that our kids are like really into or want to go camping but <laughs> who asked them <laughs> who asked them eh they don't know what they're missing and then see the tv should be able to swivel out but i'm not going to mess with it too much wow i am totally impressed Help me. I want this. <laughs> no, but realistically, we're probably going to rent one. Find a way to rent one first. And then save up for, um, save up for it. If we like the experience. Yeah, realistically. I'm so impressed with that one, boo. Ken's telling me this one that I just went in, as beautiful as it is, the minivan would not be able to support the weight. Yeah. But this one would be fine, right? Uh, it's pushing it. It's at the edge, though. Yeah. Yeah. All right, let's see. Yeah, these are different brands. Let's see this one. Oh, this one's even bigger. Hell, I can tell this one's bigger. Yeah, it's got two stairs well, let me see 294 dbhs whatever that means wow wow now this one is like nana's on the trip with us the whole family maybe even uncle Bashir. this one is huge yeah this is crazy this is literally like just sell your belongings and just live out of here. I mean, you got an L-shaped kitchen. 
Oh, wow. Yeah, you have a three gas burner. Look at that. Stainless steel. You've got an oven. I don't know. Yeah, this is an oven plus microwave. What? You've got this big sink um, with the, uh, yeah, the metal rack again. Oh, my goodness. Here. Let me see how many beds. One, two. And I bet you there's another bed over there. Yeah. yeah there's a whole queen that's over like there. The, yeah, that's like the master. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. It's a whole master bedroom, right? Co yeah, cozy. With, with lights, yeah. Oh my goodness. Wow. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah, I don't even need this. This to me is like See, too much. And then a TV. Yeah, you have a TV mount. You got the uh, window. Yeah, we got the window. So you got there. maybe some closet hanging. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Habiba, close your mouth. You keep saying, wow. <laughs> Fridge. Let's see if this is the bathroom. Yep, it's a full bathroom, boo-boo. Mm -hmm. Let me go in here. It's yeah. a full bathroom. You see, you can stand comfortably. It's, Toilet. It's bigger than some New York apartments. No, really. Bathrooms. You know what? Honestly, this feels so much more luxurious and spacious than many New York apartments. Mm. Absolutely. Oh, they even got nice light fixtures. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Ken, don't you think the kids might like it? Our grown adults? Yeah. Yeah. So they can relive when they were eight. <laughs> no, wow. This is actually, oh, this is another bed. I guarantee yeah. you. See, that's a couch. Yeah. That probably turns into a bed. Yeah. This also definitely turns into a bed. Sure. Yeah. Yeah, that's the thing is multifunction. You know? Yeah, but this is too big for us. This is doing too much. And I'm sure this is at least, this is probably, I would have to guess, about maybe 100,000. I don't know. Yeah, but it's, it's, this it's, is probably it's up about 100,000 if I had to guess. Yeah, it's up there. Because the smallest ones that we looked at should be about um, maybe a little over 20,000. So exciting. Wow. You see how long this is? Yeah, this is a big boy. This has got like two large or four large wheels. What, what, what? And it says the unit has been winterized. So it's got, wow. So that's what it looks like. The one we just went into right now. This has got solar? Yeah, it's got solar too. Wow. So yeah, the one we were in had a bump out. That's what it is. That's why it was so big. All right, this one says Nobu. No boundaries. Nobu. You know, life is so short. You gotta do something different. You can't keep doing the same thing. <laughs> If you feel the urge to get rid of all your material things and go on the road, I say do it. <laughs> all right, here's some really itty bitty ones. Maybe let's go see what does this itty bitty one get you. I feel like these are way too small though, for real. There's no way me and you wouldn't be fighting in this. This is our budget, right? This is our budget, these little mini ones. Ken says he can see putting me in that. Yeah, no, that's more of a one person. There's no way. No way. Yeah, mm -mm. but you know, just for fun. Go in, boo-boo, go in. Can you even fit? <laughs> There's a double doors. Let me see, what do you mean, double doors? Oh, it's just got a screen, mosquito screen. I don't know how to open it. All right. Okay, let's see. Oh, with these, you can't really stand up, right? <laughs> 
Well, it can really hold one person. Oh, two. Three. Maybe two? Yeah, I guess. You yeah, I guess you could sleep two people in here, but this is truly like minimum. There's you no sleep. Fridge, yeah, you there's know. no fridge. Well, stove, you could just get one of those little countertop, you yeah. know, stoves that we have yeah. for camping. But no, this ain't it. This ain't it. This ain't it, boo boo. Don't even bring me home this and tell me you got me a nice gift. <laughs> no, these are small. I'm not even going to waste my time in that. They're too tiny, you know. I'm going to feel totally claustrophobic. I feel like get this for your dog if you have that kind of money. So, yeah, as you can see, these all have these bump outs. So, they're pretty large. A lot larger than we need and a lot larger than what our budget would allow. Um, yeah, see, these are all pretty big. Wow, this one's huge. This one's huge. You're going to need a major truck for this. Yeah. Right? You know what? I want to look inside and see what I'm missing. Wow, you can just tell by the height. Wow. Hopefully I don't fall down. Wow, this has got like upstairs. <laughs> this yeah. has got like a whole bedroom upstairs. Yeah. What? Look, there's steps. Right. You climb up steps and you go. This is a full bedroom. This what? Is, that, this is where you were stand, standing under. Oh. Um, yeah. This has got Stacked a overhang. whole bedroom. I mean, to me, you're going to live out of this maybe for a whole month. You decide to travel the USA yeah. with your whole family maybe for one to two months because yeah. you got money like that. <laughs> yeah, it's really like a mobile home without yeah, a, like... without without the engine, that's all. Right, right, a whole shower stall, nice sink. Wow, oh, it's one of those like Jack and Jill, mm -hmm. this bathroom opens up. Is that what it's called? Two entrances, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, to the bedroom. Wow. Yeah, I know this is just too much. I feel too much for what we need. But I wanted to show everyone what the options were. You know, you know when it's um, big is when they have a fireplace looking <laughs> section. <laughs> Let me, oh, I haven't sat Ele in any of the chairs. So no, see, no, you got- um, Electric fireplace. You got your couch, you got your TV. A window here. Wow, this couch is quite roomy. You've got like panoramic views. You've got a dinette. You've got a giant standing fridge. Just look how much space above your head you have. Yeah. Yeah, this is like a lot of space. Let me stand so they can see. Just look how much room above here. You've even got a ceiling fan. This is the only one I've seen with a ceiling yeah, fan. Yeah, it's the only one. And you've got more kitchen cabinets than many New York studio apartments. Yeah. Look how many kitchen cabinets you have. And these are realistic cabinets, soft touch. So again, a big sink. So if you're in a witness protection program, this would be a good. <laughs> you would say that. Constantly moving. Nice stove, grill stove, uh, microwave. You've got above. The microwave yeah. storage. Nice, yeah. nice, nice, nice. So this is the big boy. Yeah. Wow, this is like a large pantry. Yeah. More pantry space than many people have in their real homes. Mm. I just like that so far everything we've seen yeah. has the standing fridge because I was kind of dreading those tiny refrigerators. Yeah you know, that are counter height. Right. This is perfect. And then you come eat your food here, or you can cook a like Korean barbecue up here, um, or you can play your board games. Um, it's up to you. It's up to you. So honey, when are we going on our trip? <laughs> you should see his face. <laughs> when are we going on a trip? 
So we can see raccoons and beer. Beer? Yeah. Bear. Bears. I can't even speak. Bears. No, we can go see some beer. <laughs> I don't drink beer. Me neither, but if you want to go see some. All right. Yeah. Oh, look. You can even extend this. This mm -hmm. is like, a, oh, you can extend the. It's quite heavy. Mm -hmm. You can extend the countertop when you're in and it's closed. Right. Nice. Now I can't put it back. Oh, crap. I can't put it back. <laughs> right. Oh, and they have blinds, too, built in. So this, so this is how it extends out. So it mm. goes in to save space in the oh, section. Oh, right. So that's the bump out yeah, where this sec out. section is. Mm -hmm. But when you're on the road, somehow yeah. you can push it back yeah, in. Yeah, it's, it's electronic. It powers right. And you see the fire extinguisher. All the little details. All right. Let's go. And I fall down. Yep. Mm -hmm. Alright. Uh, bye bye, big boy. Yeah, uh, right. Lots of storage. And of course, the giant awning, you can tell. Yeah, it is a big one. <laughs> Right, that was the bedroom, right? Jeez, I can't even imagine how much this one cost. Yeah, no, it's, it's, I, I'd say it's definitely up in the hundreds. Yeah, it's definitely over 100000 for this. Definitely. So we're actually at another lot owned by the same dealership. They told us to come around and that we would find something more suitable for like the two of us, but has, you know, the modern amenities that I'm looking for and windows so here we are at a different lot so I'm just gonna go take a look in this one Nobu um, it's got the extra window that I want let's see and it's not too big I don't know boo this seems a little big too though yeah it's definitely bigger than we need wow this one's got even a whole bar whole bar up here and uh, of course, the L-shaped kitchen, so this might be a little bigger than what we need. Yeah, you can see that, right? The refrigerator is a little smaller, but it's got a lot of windows and a lot of seating. Yeah, this is definitely bigger than what we need. And these mirrors built in to the cabinet door. It's amazing when you open up your mind and you realize there's a whole world of other things that you could be doing or that other people are doing that are not part of your world. Uh, okay. Right. Yeah, I don't know. These ones look like military thingies. That one has a skylight? Yeah, I don't know. It looks like a... But look inside. All right, let me go look inside. Keep an open mind. See, I don't know. Like, this looks really friendly and happy. And this one is looking like some sort of tank during a war. And you're trying to hide. Very manly, right? <laughs> let me see. I don't know. That might be storage. Yeah. yeah, that's like storage. Storage. I heard like when you have a lot of food that has a strong scent, you should keep it in the front here if you're going to a place that has bears. Right. All right, let's see. It's the Black Series. Okay. Okay. You see me, you see me, okay. This one's definitely different. Yeah. It's got the little cute seating arrangement here. And the bed is open. I wonder if the bed stays open, then you don't have to make the bed every day. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I think it stays it's, open. I think it stays open. It's kind of like a so, bedroom. So it's very firm. So, mm -hmm. so yeah, so that tells me it stays open versus, because that's one of the downsides when you have convertible. Right. It's like it's a couch, but then it's many times the bedding's soft or it's right. 
because you can't, you know, have a cushion and it becomes a bed. It's still right. Feels so like it's got the windows. It's got storage. It's got the skylight above, yeah, so we'll up. have light. So you can get air if you want. Right. Open. I mean, I guess for two so, middle-aged people, yeah. this ain't too bad, right? It's got a little bowl sink. Right. The kitchen. What do I think of the kitchen? Well, it's got gas. Yeah. That's good. That's good. It's got, what is this? Is this a dishwasher or oven? What is that? Mm -hmm. Oh, fridge. the fridge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's yeah. that tiny ass fridge. No, honey, we like to eat. Yeah, that's, that's <laughs> that fridge ain't problem. it. That fridge is a problem. Yeah, I was willing. Everything seems okay until the fridge. Yeah, that fridge is for a skinny little girl somewhere who only eats pieces of shrimp. If yeah, that. if that. I mean, yeah. And the bathroom, you know what? It's actually kind of cute. Showers on the right. You know, yeah, you've got to shower separately with the fan. You've got the sink, you've got storage, a toilet, but yeah, that little stove is, is not, I mean, fridge is not it. Darn it, darn it, and I bet you this isn't too expensive. Oh, by the way, everything that we've seen that we've liked, when we talk to the, I guess, finance guy or the guy, sales. the sales guy, it's actually quite a few thousand dollars cheaper than we thought, or at least than I had thought. So that's good. At least we looked. I mean, yeah, no, because I was going to say, even if it didn't have a kitchen, but then if we're traveling far, you usually want to stock a fridge. Okay, let's go. So sorry, Black Series not you let's go back to this forest river the only thing with this one is it just didn't have the outside large window well it has it on the side one, yeah it has the good seating has a nice little kitchen two stove burner has the standing fridge the only thing with this one is it feels a little dark only because there's no skylight and it's got the giant bed that you wouldn't have to make. I mean, mm, I will say that this one is on the list. It's on the list. It's on the list. Sam, how hard would it be to? Um, it's like two things it's missing. It you see, light. I wish it or a window. You see, it doesn't have the window back here, That's and it saying. doesn't have skylight Save either. Money. Right. And then for a thousand dollars or whatever, you add a, you add the light. Yeah, the but window. we don't want to do all that. You want to if you're gonna spend money like this, you want it to come the way you want it to come, yeah. right? I mean, yeah. I mean, it's got this window. Maybe the blinds are on, but. Yeah. All right, we're hoping this might be the one. Hopefully, because it's got the single wheel, which means it's smaller and it has the big window in the front that I like. So you see, if you want light, you wanna see that it has either a skylight or a large window, or both. But I'm okay if it doesn't even have a skylight, as long as it has this large window here, plus the side. So let's go inside and hope it has a large enough refrigerator. <laughs> yeah. And it's got the awning and storage and hookups. Yeah, I'm sure we've seen, we've seen, we've seen so many at this point. Um, yeah, so with this, it's not the permanent bed. You would have to make the bed, I think, yeah. But I'm okay with not having a bed, you know, that just lives out all the time. You want to be able right, to you know, space. I'm okay with that. Oh, you, you know what it is that I didn't like about this? What? This is not gas. Uh, this electric. is electric. 
Right. It's like you, you win some, you lose some. But on the other hand, then you bring a gas stove, portable gas stove. For outside. For outside. That's all right. That's else. true. And if it's electric, then it's you, you don't have to worry so much having gas. Hmm. You just make sure you charge up. And then you have a backup. Is Right. Maybe we'd then just do gas cooking outside. We right. do a portable gas outside. And also, you think about safety reasons, less likely to have gas leaks and stuff. The only thing is when you're off grid... Mm -hmm gas is a little bit more yeah that's why you yeah, that's true but. convenient but okay yeah we've got the fridge the so big fridge good. is back so that's good <laughs> it even has um a fireplace i think this is yeah it yeah fireplace, so, just to give so you and it's got so this one's not bad overall and you can stand in the shower right yeah yeah Got the toilet, you got a sink, got a vanity mirror, you got storage, you got a ooh, you got a proper corner yeah. corner oh, shower. Yeah. This looks like it's actually quite comfortable. Yeah. I mean technically it's got a skylight in the shower. Oh. You know, technically. Yeah. Okay. This one's not bad. Right. This one's not bad. Right. Now that we've looked at everything. It feels very roomy in here. No, that's the other thing too. It does. Feel it does, roomy. right? It yeah. feels roomy. So you're not banging into each other. So this is what it looks like on the side of the stove. Fire extinguisher. Switch for the stove and outlet. And it tells you how much energy or power source. Oh, it's got the even the TV hookup. Yeah, I think this might be it. This might be it, y'all. Little dinette. Oh, I'm going to have so much fun decorating it. <laughs> it's like having a cute little space to decorate. How adorable. How adorable. Oh, and the microwave on this one is below. Okay. But, yep, we got the standing fridge, so good. Good, 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 good. And the bed is in the back. Right. It feels bigger, the bed area, because, yeah, you see, it does have a small bump out. But it is one wheel. And the capacity should be appropriate for our van. You see, it has the fresh water connection, city water connection. So we came, we saw. All right, Boo Boo, overall, what was your overall your opinion or thoughts about it i'm packing up and leaving i quit i'm done why you gotta be so dramatic i'm done pack it up going gotta, to the woods gotta be so dramatic what did you think i know it's really pretty out here right now it's about well it's after 5 p.m boo for real I got you going down my rabbit hole. You always do. You always do. There's always some adventure with you. I don't know. We'll yep. Inspired by some Korean YouTube videos. I mean, camping has always been on our bucket list, though. Yeah. But, but I always but envision is, but, not on the floor in a tent. Is, yeah, we have different visions of camping. Right. You know, Ken used to tell me about camping, and he's talking about pitching a tent. <laughs> And you know all of that, and I'm like, no, 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 no. Where are we gonna sleep? Where are we gonna sleep? See, this fixes all of that. If you want to do a tent thing, we can still pitch a tent outside of the uh, camper, because I've seen people do that a lot. They pitch a tent and they, you know, do their cooking outside. If you have a big gas stove or you know something portable, or you want more space, you can still bring a tent with you. But here. You also get the uh, amenities of a proper bathroom. Hello. Man, Who's going to dig a hole and go do their business outside? Not me. Me. <laughs> That's the whole point. And here, when you have a camper, even if it's snowing, if it's raining, you don't have to worry. So, it's definitely a 10 out of 10 for me. <laughs> <laughs> it's a 10 out of 10 for me and encourage us to start traveling a little bit more around the country without having to pay for a hotel. What? 
10 out of 10. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoy this video and give us a thumbs up. If you've ever gone camping yourself and you have some tips for us, please leave them in the comments. And will you be going anywhere soon in a camper or RV? <laughs> Let me know in the comments. Again, thank you so much for watching and we'll see you soon. Bye!